Hello, BookTube. Uh, today we're on the fifth and final shelf, the bottom shelf of the first bookshelf on this book tour. Um, I'm going to start off here on the first of a series called The Wonders of Man, Newsweek. This one's on Versailles. Uh, pretty good sized books. Versailles by Christopher Hibbert, a well-known historian, popularizer, and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. Yeah. Wonders of Man, Milton Grendel, or excuse me, Gendel, consulting editor, 1972, Newsweek Book Division. Uh, starts off with uh, Versailles in history, a new chateau arises, paintings of the construction. Some of the gardens. Louis XIV and all his splendor. In the back here we have like a yellowish or creamy colored paper and it's uh, excerpts from letters and that sort of thing that have some relationship to Versailles. Uh, in this case, uh, these letters about the death of the Sun King. Uh, and we have a section on Americans at Versailles. Uh, Benjamin Franklin here, writing that letter. So there's the first off the shelf in that series. This next one, The Kremlin, Wonders of Man, Newsweek. I enjoy this one because I've actually been to The Kremlin. This one is The Kremlin by Abraham Asker and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. And uh, this one would be 1972. Nice. Start here. The Byzantine era type stuff. Catherine the Great in a cartoon there. March 8, 1917. Crab. Of course, during the Soviet era. This one's the uh, Hagia Sophia. Constantinople. There's the end papers. I don't know if it's the same on both sides. I guess they look like a mosaic. Hagia Sophia by Lord Kinross and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. Again, 1972. These are very nicely illustrated throughout. Again, on this creamy paper in the end, um, like here's a section that's 
novelist's tours. Fun stuff. Next in the series is Tower of London. Pen papers. Again, this one's by Christopher Hibbert and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. Again in the Wonders of Man series, Venice. And papers. This is by John H. Davis and the editors of Newsweek Book Division. We have the White House, again in the Wonders of Man series. So far, that's what all of these have been. By Kenneth W. Leash and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. And again, in the back on the cream colored paper, uh, various excerpts from writings regarding the White House. This one's uh, Helen H. Taft. There you go. We have, again, in the Wonders of Man Newsweek series, we have the Statue of Liberty. was by Oscar Hamblin and the editors of Newsweek Book Division. This was 1971. Looks up there falling under construction. The Alhambra, again in the Wonders of Man series, Newsweek. By Desmond Stewart in the Newsweek Book Division. Pyramids and Sphinx, Wonders of Man, Newsweek, and Papers. This one's by Desmond Stewart and the editors of the Newsweek book. Nineteen seventy-one again. Paladin Armor. Wonders of Man, Newsweek, The Coliseum. And papers. 
Yeah, we'll put it on there. By Peter Quinnell and the editors of Newsweek Book Division. Uh, 1971. The story of the Coliseum. And then this is the El Escorial, Wonders of Man, Newsweek. Pen paper. By Mary Cable and the editors of the Newsweek Book Division. Nineteen seventy one. Finally, in this series, Wonders of Man, Newsweek, the Taj Mahal. There are the end papers. By David Carroll in the Newsweek Book Division. Newsweek, in New York. 1972. And that does it for this first half of the shelf. Um, these were the Wonders of Man by Newsweek. Thank you, BookTube.